Yes, my name's Mary Davies, and I'm almost a local here now because I've lived here for some 20 years. And when I came, they told me that you had to be here 20 years before you were a local. <laughs> and I've been involved in such a lot of stuff here with uh, my music and singing and uh, writing. I've been, I had to write a couple of songs about the island. Well, I'll, re I'll read you this little one. Russell Island is the place to be. The island of Russell is in South Morton Bay. This is my home and it's where I'm going to stay. Though sometimes I travel, wander and roam, I'm never as happy as when I sail home. The hawks and the kites surf the thermals above. The birds in the trees sing carols of love. There's an aura of friendship as tides ebb and flow. I know I belong here where the sea breezes blow. I walk on the jetty, feel the island's embrace. I'm telling you, mate, it's just a fabulous place. If you were to see it, I'm sure you'd agree. Russell Island is the place to be. This, is, this one, of course, is, is more like what people have mostly heard about, the Russell Island. And this one's called Russell Rubbish. I'm sure that you would all have heard Russell Island is unique and disappears beneath the brine many times a week. I was asked where I resided when overseas one day and replied, I come from Russell Isle, out in Morton Bay. The stranger looked at me askance and said, That must be terrible. However do you manage? Are all your homes submersible? I thought, you poor deluded fool. I will not burst your bubble. And said, indeed, if it were not so, we'd be in deep, deep trouble. It can be a nuisance if we're out and miss the incoming tide. Then we have to wait for it to ebb ere we can get inside. Most folk have a mangrove tree to rest in in their yard, with ladders hanging from them so climbing down is not too hard. When it's sunny, we use mirrors. Oh, we all know our Morse code, and have flashy conversations all up and down the road. If you're stuck at the RSL or the bowls club, well, that's okay. For the girls swim around in their wetsuits, <laughs> serving drinks from a plastic tray. Tree branches there get crowded, or oh, there's a fine for breaking them down. If you don't take your turn on the booze boat, you could get pushed off, perhaps even drown. Some, of course, are not drinkers, so for pleasure they snorkel a lot. And gardeners are kept quite busy mowing seagrass on their plots. He shook his head in amazement. I said, why not come over sometime? You might like to buy some land there. He said, thanks, but I think I'll decline. I must say, I felt quite guilty as I turned and left him there. For my hydro home on Russell is for me beyond compare. <laughs> Thank you. 